Hi everyone, this is Ada. Welcome back to my channel and this is Belle, my beautiful Westie. Um, we are just about to go on the City Cat with Belle. Um, in Brisbane there is a trial on to take dogs on the ferries or the City Cat and the trial goes for three months and the only stipulation, well, well there's a couple of stipulations but they have to be muzzled or in a dog carrier of some sort. So we are going to try her with a muzzle. We actually went to the um, pet shop and bought this muzzle. I had um, some advice from the lady at the shop and also from, are you looking at me baby? You good girl. Um, from two friends that are vet nurses and they gave me the advice to buy one of the cage muzzles, which is sort of like a cage, fits on their face, you'll see later on in the picture. Um, because even though it looks probably pretty bad, it gives them freedom to still pant and just um, open their mouth, whereas some of the soft uh, muzzles, you can't do that. And so we did that and um, we're going to go and try it, aren't we? Um, Belle loves to come with us and we love to take her. So um, I feel while a muzzle is a bit overdone for her, she's not a vicious dog, she loves everybody. But I think we need to do it to support our community to allow dogs to be allowed on city cats and hopefully buses later on or even trains because in Europe or in Paris, for example, when we went over there on holidays, they were in hotels, they were in cafes, restaurants, um, even in Louis Vuitton. And um, Peter and I were walking along, we thought, oh, they're just gonna stop at the door, but they just glided on through. And like my mouth dropped over and I think in Brisbane or in Australia, so poor. So I'm trying to support um, this uh, doggies, or our babies, our fur babies on the city cat so that um, we can make things a bit better for our um, pets or our dogs. So if we have to muzzle, hopefully in the short term, um, it will be a lot better than, than I thought, or, you know, will improve. So Bells actually doesn't know it, but she's about to go on the ferry. And this will be something very different, but we've got to put a muzzle on her, unfortunately. Come on, darling. Are you going on the city cat? You have to wear a muzzle, honey. Okay, but you're going to love it. Mummy's got some treaties for you. Oh, someone's sneezing. So, because Belle has to be muzzled, um, it's a little treaty, so um, I don't like the thought of muzzling, but there is a trial on the city cat in Brisbane. Uh, for about three months and dogs are allowed in certain spots on the city cat but they have to be muzzled um, i'm trying to look at it as um, she'll be fine so i've bought these treats she's trying to get them now um, because when we bought the muzzle the lady said just you know make it a pleasant experience for us so i'm trying to think that if she wears it every time she goes on the city cat she'll start to think oh lovely day going out get some treaties so what do you think, Bill? City cat? City cat time? So the city cat's coming, so Peter's gonna put it on her, which is probably not easy. Do you want me to help or you're right? Oh. Put her down. Uh, sit down, sit down. Daddy's gotta put that on. It's all right, good girl, good girl. No, it looks uncomfortable. It looks uncomfortable, but you'll be right, baby. Okay. Fix it at the front there. Okay. So, oh. where are we going? Where are we going, baby? Just Good girl. girl.
Here, Belle. Look at mummy. Oh, Have yeah. a good time. You go back on the city cat. Back on the city cat home. It's a hot day. Are you hot, Belle? You get back on the city cat? You get back on the city cat? Mm -hmm. We're on our way home now, aren't we, Belle? Yes, You've we been are. a very good girl. Went to the dog park. So we've just come back. It's a hot day. The only thing is very hot, um, but we went two stops. So we went from where we live, two stops to the dog park and she had a play in the park. Um, it went really, really well. The muzzle went on just before we got on the city cat, but I actually bought um, these treats that are a bit more expensive, but um, like dried chicken. I was able to feed her through the muzzle and she hardly even knew it was on. Um, so, and when she got on, she was looking and you know, the wind was blowing in her face so she actually loves that um, so when we got off we took it um, off her we had no problems and I think um, people are building up this muzzle thing maybe to be worse than what it is I think if you buy the right muzzle and you train your dog to wear this muzzle I think it's going to be fine believe me if she had been distressed at all it would have been straight off and we never would have done it again but she went really well and I'm so glad she did because we can take you next time when it's not as hot. I think we'll go next time when it wasn't as hot um, because we had to actually sit outside too. That was one of the, the things we have to be at the back of the city cat with the muzzle on and only um, criticism I'd have for that day was a bit too hot but it was very, a good experience wasn't it Belle? So don't forget everyone, Ada Love Style, see you again next time, bye. If you like this video, please subscribe, push like, and follow me on Instagram. And don't forget everyone, Ada Love Style. See you again next time. Bye.